In Tokyo, there is an ever rotation of themed cafes, especially anime cafes. Recently, I was lucky enough to stumble across a cafe from one of my favorite animes ever, Natsume Yujincho. Now, I don't want to go into huge detail about the anime, but it follows the daily life of a high school boy who can see yokai or demons, and the obvious struggles that can accompany that. Okay, there, summary over. Anyways, it is a beloved anime in Japan, having six seasons out already and a very recognizable cast of characters. With the release of the most recent season, it makes sense to celebrate with a cafe. The Natsume Cafe is a collaboration cafe with Akihabara's Honey Toast Cafe. There's a special themed menu with different character drinks and meals. Anime cafes often use characteristics from the show's cast to pick their drinks. We ended up getting Young Grandmother Reika's Yuzu Ginger Ale and Natori's Ice Matcha Milk, complete with chocolate salamander. <laughs> to go along with each item ordered, customers received a Nyanko Sensei button. There are 20 different kinds of buttons that you could randomly get. Also, this cafe was a bit different from the usual cafes. Instead of ordering at the table, we had to go up to the regular cafe counter to order. This didn't really matter to us, and there were actually some pretty cute decorations in the main area. After we got our drinks, next came the main courses. My friend got the Nyanko Sensei pancakes. These are topped with sesame and orange whipped cream to give them that signature Nyanko Sensei pattern. These were really cute and the sesame whipped cream was really strong and had a very good sesame flavor. I got Madara's potato cheese gratin dish with his fierce eyes looking up at you. Not as easy as you thought it would be, huh? Oh. This was seriously delicious and I would definitely recommend both of these dishes if you decide to come visit. Now, because this seemed like the only opportunity, I decided to do something really dangerous and probably stupid. Of course, the host cafe Honey Toast Cafe is known for having honey toast. This is a Japanese sweet where a loaf of bread is toasted and topped with all kinds of sweet goodies. And then, the whole thing is eaten. I've never done something this dangerous and, in retrospect, completely stupid before. So the Natsume Cafe's signature dessert was this Nyanko Sensei Honey Toast. It was topped with a stick of dongo, ice cream, whipped cream, Nyanko's red bean bun, crackers, and lots and lots of honey. The inside of these things are not hollow, by the way. The loaves of bread are cut into cubes to help people eat them, and the whipped cream and honey soaks into these cracks. It was truly ridiculous. I've never heard one of these before. Oh, it's cut a little bit. Oh, look at that. <laughs> You monster. You monster. How is it? It's got red bean paste inside. Ooh, yummy. Just a little bean paste puff thing. It's good. Yay! If you are in the Akihabara area and want to try out the Natsume Cafe, I do highly recommend despite the immediate carb coma and sugar stroke. I feel terrible. <laughs> it just feels so sick. It was a really good experience, but seriously, be prepared if you want to try that honey toast.